white-shirted Bolton Wanderers get set at the Manor Road ground Headington to tackle the home 11. Headington, the only non-league club left in the FA Cup's fourth round, have grown from almost nothing five years ago to become the champions and cup holders of the Southern League. But they'll have to fight every inch of the way in this match, for Bolton weren't last year's cup runners-up for nothing. What's more, Bolton are quick to adapt themselves to the icy surface. Headington's biggest ever crowd watched the Bolton machine go into action. A corner to Bolton, could be a goal here. 18-year-old Ray Parry takes it. Wheeler races in and gives Nat Lofthouse a chance. A flick of the foot and Bolton are one up. Still fighting to become the cup giant killers, Headington, with Duncan leading the attack, comes storming back. Peart keeps the attack going with a pass to the centre. Bolton get the ball out of danger and head for the home team's goal. Anxiously, goalie Ansel waits for Parry to shoot, but he can't stop it. Another one to Bolton. A corner to Headington gives Maskell a fairly easy one, but he's wide off the mark. And Headington still haven't scored by half-time. Bolton, with two in the bag, continue to hammer away when play resumes. Parry, number 11, puts in some good work despite the slippery pitch. A few moments later, Parry takes a free kick, and Moyer heads it in. Bolton three, Headington still no score. Headington may be down, but they're far from out. Smith, Duncan and Peart team up. Peart shoots, and there's one for Headington. Now Headington let their hair down and give as good as they've been getting. Goalie Hanson and Peart collide. And all oh, that ground's cold. Hanson takes the goal kick, and all eyes turn as it sends Bolton off on the attack again. Inside left, Stevens has it, and his shot beats them all. 4-1 to Bolton. Banks, Bolton's left back, gives a neat display as he tries a solo run. Eddington have it again. The ball goes to centre-forward Smith, who hooks it into the net. Headington two, Bolton four. Headington, a gallant, great-hearted team, go down fighting. Next stop for the Wanderers is round five, and perhaps Wembley again.